Hey Toy Friends, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to be filming our weekly plan with me. Um, before we get started though, I want to introduce myself. My name is Michaela Barnhart. If you are new around here, um, I am a first year second grade teacher in South Carolina. If you are not new here, then thank you for coming back and sticking around and hanging out with us. Um, I am so thankful for this YouTube channel. I feel like it is such an outlet for me. Um, and I know I have been off on filming for a while, so I'm very excited to kind of try to get back into it um, and just kind of see what I can roll out for you guys. So like I said, today's video is going to be our month or our weekly plan with me. Um, I quickly want to share our kit that we are doing. If you have been um, watching me for a little while, you know that for a while now, like months and months and months, I have been making my own kits um, and I love doing that. It just took so much time and I have a very limited amount of time now in the afternoons because of work and everything. So I decided to purchase my kits for the rest of this year at least and maybe even going forward just starting to do that again because I enjoy it. It brings me joy to get kits in the mail and be able to unbox them with you guys. Um, I did just film an unboxing of my Planner Kate order. I also just filmed my October plan with me. Um, so that's probably going to be going up after this video, but I'm going to kind of give you a little sneaky peeky today um, of that. So anyways, though, that all being said, we are using a kit that I purchased from Planner Kate for this video. So this is Mini Kit 256. I grabbed Sheet C, which is the sampler. And then I also grabbed Sheet EV2, which is the hourly version for this. Um, this is a kit that came from last year's. So this is one of last year's kits. Um, I don't think, I think it was like a sale item or whatever. Um, but anyways, I picked it up because I love the way it looked. Thought it would be perfect for October and this fall-ish weather. Um, so that's what we're going to use today. I did not, however, pick up the strip headers because I haven't been using them even when I've been planning myself. Um, let's see, or maybe I have been, I can't remember. No, okay, so like when I've been planning for myself, I have not been using them and I like the more simplistic look of not having those. So we're not going to have them here either. Um, I'm not sure how this is all going to look, so we're just going to kind of fit it where we can and figure it out together. Um, but anyways, let's go ahead and get right into it. So I'm going to start with the sampler sheet. I always set up my sidebar over here first. So that is what we're going to start with. I love this little pumpkin. It's so cute. Um, so that's where we're going to start anyway. Uh-oh, that was very loud. Oops, I gotta go down a little bit. It's gonna go off the top of the page. Let's go to this one. What happens if we go down to this one? All right, that works. That is so cute, I love that. Um, anyway, so we have that there. Then I also am going to put in some little script stickers over here. Oh, no, please don't, okay. I thought it was going to break. So we'll put in a little to-do sticker so that we can put some to-dos. I also usually put in a little to-call and to-go just in case we have any of those. And then I also use the this week sticker down here to kind of put some videos in if I know any ahead of time that are going to go out that week. So I'm going to leave that blank all for, or I'm going to leave that blank for right now just so that we can kind of have it there, but I'm not going to put anything as of yet. Um, so the next thing that I'm going to do is actually use this washi at the bottom. Um, I just love the way that the washi looks at the bottom, even though I've not been using it when I've been doing my own kits. Um, so I thought now that I had the washi, might as well use it, right? Right. So let's get that lined up. So I feel like I kind of need to chat about why I have been sort of absent in the realm of YouTubing. Um, I have just been having a rough time adjusting to first year teaching life and just teaching life in general. Um, I feel like this year is so weird because we are still kind of like in the COVID era, but people are trying to start moving on. Um, and so it leaves us in the schools in a weird spot because you have some people who want to still wear masks. You have some people who don't. Um, and obviously we're trying to kind of just kind of appease who we can. 
So it's just difficult. And then all of the contact tracing and stuff that we have to do, everything that's kind of dumped onto teachers is just so much more right now because of everything going on. Um, so it's just, it's a lot and it's a lot to take in for your first year of teaching. So I'm trying to just keep happy and keep reminding myself of that, um, that it will get better. It just takes time. Um, so yeah, that's just kind of where I'm at with that right now. We also have two new puppies in our house, which I have shown before. And then last Saturday, we found a stray dog um, that we have taken in. He is on our front porch. He's just kind of hanging out. We feed him water every day, we go outside and play with him. Um, we have lovingly named him Tank because he is huge. He's a pit bull, we think, or some kind of pit bull mix maybe. Um, but he's literally so loving. Like he loves belly rubs. He loves treats. He loves to give kisses and hugs. He just is so sweet and he's so good with our dogs. Um, so we're just kind of trying to figure out what's going to happen there. <laughs> we're not sure yet if we're going to try to get rid of him or rehome him. We tried to rehome him. We tried to find owners first, obviously, and could not. We think somebody put him out um, because of where we found him. But yeah, so we just have had a lot going on and it's been hard for me to kind of keep up with YouTube as well as juggling everything else. So anyway, so let's get back into this because right now I'm just rambling on and on and on. I did not think this part through. I'm realizing now that I did not order washi for the week and usually I use washi to mark when I'm going to be out of the house or I get school. So we're just going to have to... Um, get creative without washi. Um, so let's see, what can we do? Let's just put, goodness, there's a little nap lying around. I'm so aggravating. Um, this is difficult. What are we gonna do? Do, 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 do. What are we gonna do, 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 do? Let's see if we have anything else going on this week. I have a chiropractor appointment on the 12th at 3.30. Let's go ahead and put that in real quick. Let's use one of these little ones because it's a quick appointment. Is this? Yeah, this is 12th. So we got that there. I'm wondering if I should just put in these for school. Like that maybe and just write the times for school. Let's just see how that would look because I mean really that truthfully is my only option at this point. And then I can just mark that I will be at school. Obviously, I know I'll be at school, um, but I just like to see the washi kind of block that time out. Um, so I may have to go back and order washi for the next few weeks, kids, since I did not do that to start with. Okay, let's just kind of see how this is gonna look. Um, so, I don't like that, but that's okay. It's gonna be okay. Let's just move on. So we have that there. And then on Saturday, we don't have anything going on um, except for, I think it is his Saturday to work, the 16th. So I'm just gonna put a little like bar up here just so I can note that it is his Saturday to work. Um, so I'll be at home Saturday morning by myself, which is fine. And then I also wanna put in church Sunday so we'll put that in with this little two hour block it's a little crooked and then I also want to squeeze in our little family time that we have every Sunday um, we always go either they come to my house or we go to my sister's house or my mom's house we all eat lunch together um, so I'm going to put that there and then just because I have this sticker, I'm going to put planner time down here. I don't always do that, but I feel like why not when I was given the sticker to use. So let's squeeze that in down there. Okay. So there is that. Um, I do, let's see, what else do I need to put in? We don't have any dates off or anything like that this week. I've got in that chiropractor appointment. Um, don't have anything here. I don't have any, I don't think I have any after school meetings or anything this week. So that's good. So I think that's it. So let's go ahead and put in some check boxes for the week. 
I always just put them down at the very bottom just so that I know that they're there and I can use them as needed but that it's not taking up a lot of like space that I could potentially have like an appointment or something come up um and I mean even if it did I could just erase or whatever or like pull the sticker back up and white out I guess not erase but white out Jeremiah's getting on to our dogs it sounds like they are interesting characters for sure all right so what else can we chat about I'm trying to think if there's I feel like there's so much I haven't told you guys um so yeah we got that new pup our puppies are still obviously potty training um which is more of a struggle than I thought it would be honestly it's not as easy as it you would think, I guess. I don't know. I knew it wasn't going to be easy by any means, but easier than it actually is. Let's put Saturdays up here. Okay. And then let's go back over here to where she has stuff. I really wanted to be able to use these, but I feel like that's a lot to put right there. So, but I really want to be able to like use it and check it off. What if we do it like that? Laundry day. And then there's one that says clean house. We can do it like that, I guess. We don't have grocery time this week because we shop for every two weeks and this is not a week for that. So we don't have anything like that to put in. Um, I do want to put in, I'm just going to put this little heart over here for family time. And then I think that's it. Let's go ahead and go in with the pen. I think that's it for stuff I need to put in. So let's go ahead and go back up here and we'll just put in school. School this week is going to be a little bit different um, because of parent conferences at the end of the week um so our schedule is a little bit off wednesday we always work from seven to four this looks terrible against the coil <laughs> um thursday is where it gets a little different so we have to work seven to six thirty so we have a full school day from seven to three where or seven to two fifteen ish where kids are with us and they go home. And then at three o'clock to six thirty we have parent teacher conferences. Um so that's why it's a little bit different. And then Friday we still have a regular day, but from seven to ten thirty we have kids, and then from eleven to three we have parent teacher conferences. Wow, the sun's coming out. <laughs> I was not expecting that to happen. Why does this always happen to me? so aggravating it's been so cloudy all morning and now the sun's gonna come out and kind of mess up my lighting here your shadows everywhere um anyway so we have that down here we have our was it 3 30 i can't remember yes we have a 3 30 chiropractor appointment and then over here we have jeremiah is working And then we have church from 10 to 12. We have church. And then we have family time. Okay. I think that's it for that stuff. So I wonder what put... Just because I like the way these little stars look, I'm going to put them up here at the little 6 o'clock because um, I'm not going to be doing anything except getting ready at 6 o'clock in the morning. So, I'm going to put that up there just to have something a little extra added in. Okay. So, there's that. Is there anything else I can think of? I don't think so. I don't think there's anything right now that I need to put over here. So I think this is pretty, whoa, pretty much it um, for this little weekly plan with me. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm actually pretty happy with the way it turned out. Even though I don't have the washi, that would be the only thing that I would want to add at this point. 
Um, I do think it looks cute without the strip headers at the top. I just love the simplicity. Now, had this been one of those older planners where they had color up here, um, that would have not flown well with me. So we would have covered that up. But since they did keep it so empty and just like light and bright, I'm really enjoying that. So anyways, though, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. We're going to go ahead and close it out before the sun decides to come out even more and make even more shadows. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe so that you can stick around for all my videos to come. And I will catch you guys in the next one. All right. Bye, guys.